feed the materials here. There's screws and rotating. So rotating to bring materials here and horizontal feeding is also rotating into the inner furnace. There will be motors to drive the screw conveyors. When it's fit into the inner chamber, the inner chamber is rotating also. And you check it drives by number one and number two chain. So the whole the whole drum roller it is rotating walking. It is rotating walking. This is the inner part and you see the white color it is the insulation layer and this is the frame the outer one you see as you see this is the frame the inner one it is using high grade boiler carbon steel and for ex external heating uh, for preheating they are burning by this hose five hose the bottom hose it is using the gas produced from carbonization so it is it is different hose these are using the ex external heating let the liquid gas for preheating we burn gas from these holes after it's producing wood gas then we use the bottom parts holes ignition it's burning inside and it is like uh, this one and this one is like like the lighter z like the lighter z And I show you uh, because we didn't add these. When we add external heating, guys, we uh, ignition by electricity from here, and we we bring the air into the preheating by the draft fan. This fan only need for preheating period. When it's producing with guys, then we don't need we don't we need, we we can stop it. There will be valve to generate the air to promote heating burning. Every every ignition noise will have a valve, and this is this tube to adjust. Uh, the liquid gas for preheating and the, it, this tube is bring the air for burning there will all be valves and to control each pot i mean this pot it all be adjustable after heating well the materials carbonizing will produce wood guys flammable and the smoke coming out from the furnace is continuously producing smoke and continuously the smoke will coming out from here and then all go through these purification tubes See this coming from here, and these tubes all connect with water. And this one, this one, this one, the first three tubes, they are 
Supreme water at the top. Supreme, the water supreme. This three is supreme, and then others. These others is concentration. There's inner tubes to cool the smoke for second time, and this is the buffer tube. The guys will be uh. Will after buffer and then this draw of fun is bring the smoke through and circulation working. This one is also buffer tube. After treated, the clean guys will go through this tube back to furnace for heating. You see, from here to the bottom, big. Big tubes, big pipes, and then separate uniform amount. And using this, the bottom ignition noise back to furnace for heating. And if it, there's producing extra gas, we burn here. There is valve too. If you don't need so much, guys, we can do. We can tighten, tighten the valve. Then the guys into the furnace will be will be reduced. There is valves too. After carbonized, the charcoal will discharge from the bike here. This tube is cooling tube. We will add water from here, and the charcoal will be cooled by the surrounded cool water, and discharge from here. Connect this tube here, and discharge after cooled here. We use this device to cool down the whole system water. The temperature. We cool down the water for purification and the cooling using this device. So this is the whole system. Hope you can understand. And it is with an angle. Like this, so from from that side, I'm rotating discharge this side.